Let's do this dosage calculation together for heparin. So we have heparin 700 units per hour. We want IV continuous infusion. We have a bag with 20,000 units that's in 250 milliliters of normal saline. So what is the flow rate gonna be in milliliters per hour? So we're gonna start off with our units to the left of the equal sign. And the first thing we wanna put in here is something with our milliliters. So if we look back at our equation, we have our bag that is 250, and then that bag has 20,000 units. So that's our first fraction. Next, we wanna get our units up here so we can cross those off since we wanna to get to our milliliters. So we're gonna take 700 units and put that over an hour, and we already have hours, so we don't have to do any conversions there. We're gonna cross off these units. We're gonna multiply and divide, which I already did. We're gonna come out with 8.75, 8 and then you always wanna look at what you're rounding to, and I have nearest tenth right here. So we're gonna go ahead and round up because we have a five, we're gonna round that up to eight, and we have 8.8 .8 milliliters per hour as our final rate.